I'm a lumberjack and I'm okay. <laughs> Sorry, when I saw this shirt on camera, I'm like, wow, I look like I'm a lumberjack or a lumberjack's wife, which I am neither. Um, hi, I'm Anne Samoylov, and uh, this is your 30 Days to Your Launch video series. I've been doing... I'm, my personal challenge to myself is that I'm making a video every day to share something that's going on behind the scenes in my own launch for the fourth round of Fearless Launching. And today I just wanted to uh, just share a little nugget of info about launching, how it affects your business, and um, basically here's the deal. You know, you launch and you get really focused on all of those pieces of the launch. And what can what it can feel like is that your business actually becomes the launch, which isn't actually the right way to go about it because you still kind of just have to pay the bills of the business. You still have to keep things going. That means blog posts, newsletters, you know, your regular communication. Or else down the line, things are going to kind of go off kilter and people are going to wonder, you know, you want to you want to stay consistent in those regular activities you know, especially the external ones that people see, but not just those, but the behind the scenes stuff. So even if let's say you want to do a project and you want to, uh, you know, I don't know, like one thing we're doing in the Fearless Launching alum group is we're going to start featuring a new person every few weeks. And that just means putting uh, a pinned post of, um, a pinned post up basically that, that features that person, what they do, because we've just got so many experts in there, and and I wanted to find a way to do that. So I put the call out for people, and then I was like, gosh, you know, I did this, and now I can't really spend the time making that decision. But that's not really fair to those people that you put that out to. So um, we are going to make that decision and it is going to start during the launch because that is one of those things that, you know, those people, my, my concern and my devotion or whatever isn't just to the people that I'm like, ah, come in, come in to the people I don't know yet. I have to honor and love and protect and cherish all those people that have already walked through the door and are kind of hanging out behind me and just, you know, already, already part of my world in a, in a bigger way. So that's just one example. But other things might include, you know, you wanting to start a, a you know, a blog series on some topic unrelated to your launch, you can still get that going, get that moving. So you can't let your content slide, you can't let your relationship with your customer slide, and you certainly can't um, avoid making tough decisions um, that that could actually impact your launch. So just a word to the wise. Keep an eye on your business. Launching is one activity in your business. It doesn't encompass everything. Even myself, um, I have a few external clients that I work with. I have uh, things that I've said that and committed to doing, let's say writing articles for uh, things and being involved in certain other events and helping other people promote their things. Don't forget about that stuff. You know, don't just say, you know, Either either have the forethought to to say no to them right up front, um, way before the launch happens, or just do it. You know, keep your commitments to all of those people across the board, and to and in doing so to your business. So that is what's going on today. Is me working with some of that other non-launch stuff because I don't want it to drop. I do not want it to drop. So. Um, I was going to push all of it till after all of the not so fun stuff, all the stuff that there were projects that aren't money makers, but I just had to, I had to do it. I had to take care of some things and I'm having to go through that list today. Okay. Have a great one. I'll see you tomorrow. We're almost through this and I think I'm going to do something fun and super actionable that I need your help with in the last five days of this series. Um, don't worry, it's nothing you have to do in order or anything. So even if you come across this, no problem. You'll get to it eventually. Um, have a great day and I'll talk to you soon. Take care.